Virgo. Hey Virgo, welcome back to my channel. And this is the week ahead reading for the sign of Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, or wherever you have a heavy Virgo placement. If you're new to my channel, hello. I pray before each and every one of my readings so that way my energy is protected, your energy is protected as well. If you're returning, thank you so much for returning and trusting me with your energy. I greatly appreciate it. So the first message we have here is, I would have done so much differently. Wow. So there's a lot of energy coming through with this card here. Divine Feminine, there's a masculine who is currently lingering in your energy field, okay? And they have been for some time now. I'm getting that you know exactly who this person is and you know how they feel about you as well. So this is someone you have established a very deep bond with but right now you also have some very strong feelings for them okay which could be both positive or negative and this is why you felt either deeply misunderstood or mishandled by this person which literally has you questioning everything about them and you're at this place where you genuinely wonder if you encountered the real version of them yeah Something about this masculine's energy has you feeling a little uneasy at this time. But honestly, there's still this underlying energy of curiosity. And this is mainly because you feel as if you've given them a certain level of access to you. The way your energy is coming through, Divine Feminine, you're someone who has a very open heart space, but you also don't let people in very easily. So you may be very selective in how you share your space with others. But this masculine at one point proved to be special to you, okay? And so they were given a deeper level of access to you. And I'm getting in all ways. So this could be mentally, emotionally, and sexually. But now you're wondering if that was a mistake on your part, which may ultimately have you in this place where you kind of feel called to protect your energy in some way. So you may have recently pulled back from in a major way from this masculine energy. And believe it or not, they're picking up on this. And they don't like it at all, okay? This is really triggering them right now. This is someone who you may feel like is constantly pulling on your energy. And this can manifest in you thinking about them all the time, or even seeing a lot of signs and sinks that are very, very specific to you and them. So if this is happening right now, or if this has happened in the recent past, this is because they are in fact lingering in your energy field, okay? So that may be confirmation for some of you who are wondering. But what's also being highlighted at this time is that they feel this way because their perspective of you has shifted in a major way recently. I'm also getting life-changing, which may sound a little dramatic, but this person feels like what they know now about you has changed their lives in some way, okay? And it has them in deep regret. But I'm getting very clearly that you already know this internally, Divine Feminine, but something in you may definitely be seeking some type of external validation of what you're feeling about this masculine at this time, okay? Let's get the next message here. Okay. So the next message we have here is trying to find the right words. Yeah, okay. So right now, they're focused on saying something to you or even asking you a set of questions that they know you will totally not be expecting from them. And this is actually their plan to kind of catch you completely off guard. Also, I'm getting that if it has been a while since you've spoken to this masculine, they've not only been waiting for, for this, but they also don't take this moment lightly, okay? This is someone who knows your value. And they also know that you value your time and your energy is extremely sacred to you. And so they may feel immense pressure due to this. 
because they've been trying to figure out how to tell you this, okay? And whatever this is, they don't plan on holding back in any way because they feel like this is life-changing for them. But it also affects you in some way as well, Divine Feminine, okay? The way this energy is coming through, you trigger them in a way that they've never felt before. And so they know that they have to not only approach you in a certain way, but they also have to speak to you in a certain way. This is sticking out here, okay? The way in which they present this information to you. They know that you're a feminine energy who pays very close attention to detail. They know that you pay close attention to the things that they say, almost as if you can kind of read between the lines very easily when it comes to them, okay? And this may apply to you even when they may not be very clear, okay? You have this way of decoding what it is that they say and getting to the truth of everything, okay? And they know this about you, Divine Feminine. So this has them a little bit on edge when it comes to expressing themselves to you. I'm also getting that you have no idea how much this masculine overthinks the little things like speaking to you or even simply like shooting you a text message, okay? It brings so many emotions to the surface for them, okay? I just got focus. So they may even find it hard to focus when speaking to you. So just like the sound of your voice um, may do something to them that they can't even really explain. And the way it's coming through Divine Feminine, um, I feel like this is something that you know about yourself. Maybe something that hasn't been verbalized, but definitely energetic energy coming through right now. Um, but you have this ability to carry them somewhere, okay? You make their mind wander or they find it very easy to get lost in you in this way. So they know that they have to be very intentional about what they say, almost as if they have to be firm in this way, okay, with you in this way. And not in an abrasive kind of manner, but as it pertains to really leading the conversation, really coming in with a plan, okay? It's like they're putting a lot of thought into this, okay? Um, and trying to be strategic about a conversation. So this is something that they feel like carries a heavy level of importance to them at this time. They've definitely been planning this. Um, and I feel like there's some key things that they want to express to you. And they feel like these things will change how you feel about them in some way. Because the way their energy is coming through, it's almost like they want to catch you by surprise with this information. Or kind of seek to shift how you feel in this current moment about them. They know that you have very strong feelings about them right now. This could be either positive or negative. It honestly could be a mix of both, okay? Um, and they know that you're not someone who's easily swayed verbally, okay? If you feel some kind of way, then you're usually justified in how you feel. So they definitely have put a lot of thought into executing this, okay? And they want you to acknowledge this. So they're gonna be paying very close attention to you and how you respond to them as well. Because also they, although they don't wanna come off this way, Divine Feminine, they're very sensitive to your energy. This is a masculine who feels very energetically bonded with you. They pay attention to you, okay? Um, and they know that they have to engage you in a very particular way, okay? Let's get the next message here. And this is very, very, you know, specific to where you are in your journey right now, okay? That's sticking out as well. How you feel about them right now is influencing this whole situation, okay? They can definitely read your energy very well, even if you're at a distance. Okay, the next message we have is some things last forever. Wow, okay. 
this reading is very interesting, okay? And it's also for a very specific feminine energy. So if you're resonating with this message so far, your masculine has been hit with some very intense, triggering news about your connection. And when they first came to this realization, it was, it was too much for them to accept, okay? So maybe they even tried to avoid the truth about you. But the way their energy is coming through now, they really want to unpack this. And they need to speak to you because they want to not only know if you know this, but they feel like this changes everything about your connection and your bond going forward, okay? Whether you know this or not, this masculine has been lingering in your energy lately because it's been brought to their attention that what they feel for you is not a temporary thing. This is not something that they have the luxury of turning off or even forgetting in a sense, okay? It's something that's stuck with them over time. And your masculine has been praying and actually seeking guidance from a higher power because what they feel for you, Divine Feminine, is literally making them feel crazy, okay? And the answers they received has them focused on the future right now. There's heavy emphasis on the future, okay? So whatever, like it has them literally thinking ahead. They're thinking about years from now, okay? And this is why it's, it's hitting them so intensely. Your person is definitely seeking some type of spiritual explanation for what they feel for you, but more importantly, why they only feel this with you. So this is a masculine energy who has had many experiences in their lifetimes with other feminine energy, but your energy specifically does something to them that makes you stand out from everyone else. And the main thing is the fact that you trigger them, okay? This is the key thing about you that's standing out here, you know, at this present time, because they have this ability to not dwell on most things, but when it comes to you, they almost feel like they don't have a choice, okay? They take the things that you do and you say very personal because deep down they know it is. And where they stand right now in this current moment, they've been awakened to the fact that this connection was not merely a moment in time, okay? This bond that you have is forever. And what's interesting about this is that when it comes to the twin flame journey, I think that this is something that is oftentimes overlooked. But when you sit back and really think about how powerful that is and how sacred it is, that a higher power has aligned you with this person for a lifetime, not a season of your life, not a moment, a lifetime, okay? And this is also a major factor in how you both show up in the connection because this connection is one that is, it is kind of backwards, okay? In the sense that you come into it feeling such a level of intensity from the beginning and after that, you begin to unpack the inner workings of one another as time goes by. It's like you, you don't even know why, but you want the best for this person, okay? And even when they're at a distance from you, you really, really wish them well. You know, you wish them happiness. You wish them good health, okay? It's almost like there's a higher octave of love that's operating from the very, very beginning. And this is also a higher octave of which a person has experienced in love in their lifetime. So depending on where they are on their personal journey and level of awareness, it can take them some time to not only acknowledge this, but to even feel worthy of this type of love. And so as the feminine energy, you have this ability to read them very well. So even when they're not showing you this or they're not showing up as their highest version, you can feel their heart space. And you know what it is that their higher selves are feeling even when they can't find the words or the actions to express this. But if this is resonating with you, if this message is resonating with you, this is a masculine energy who is realizing that maybe they should have handled you differently, okay? 
And the way their energy is coming through, I'm not picking up on a connection that was tumultuous or toxic in any way, but one where your person was used to a certain type of feminine energy and you showed them who you were, Divine Feminine, by how you navigated this connection. So there may have been some decisions that you had to make recently, ones that maybe were painful in the moment, or they even made you second guess yourself. Because I'm picking up on a feminine energy that had to go in this sort of protective mode. For some of you, I'm getting that you are highly spiritual and you got to a point where maybe even you begin to naturally pull back from your person without even understanding why. But you felt like, you know, you felt this inner urge to pull your energy back. And you were right in doing so because you loved yourself enough to honor your truth in those moments, okay? And because you did that, the truth was revealed to your person. So this is deeper than them realizing that they're in love with you, okay? This is them realizing that they will be in love with you for the rest of their existence, okay? Very powerful, beautiful energy coming through with this reading here. Wow. Let's get the next message. Wow. The next message we have is, I'm tired of fighting this. Yeah, I definitely feel like this is your masculine tire self coming through. Letting you know that they're tired of fighting what they feel for you. And the masculine energy I'm picking up on was doing this unconsciously. They weren't even aware that they were presenting themselves in this way, okay? Because I'm picking up on a cyclic theme to your connection. One that may have been on and off, really stop and go. One where you feel like you, you get to a certain point, things are progressing, you're looking towards the future, and then you get set back here. And they want you to know that they are honestly tired of arriving at the same place time and time again. There's a vast difference in your person, Divine Feminine, when they're with you versus when they're not with you, okay? And this is their higher self confirming that for you. So the version of them that you get may be very, very different than the version that other people in their lives get, okay? And this is becoming evident to them as well. They can feel the difference. They feel like you get the most authentic version of them or something about the alignment of your connection just feels right. But they do have a lot of questions, okay? or something that makes them naturally approach this connection with extreme caution for some reason. So Divine Feminine, this, this definitely is justifying why you felt the need to protect yourself from them in a way. And this wasn't an easy thing for you to do because this is someone you ultimately wanted to draw closer to, but because they were fighting or resisting the truth about their feelings, you had to make a choice, okay? And you chose yourself. Their higher self wants you to know that you made the right choice. And so if you are doubting that, this is major confirmation for you. And that's the thing about this connection that I'm tapping into here. There's a deep level of respect and also a very deep spiritual bond. Not only for one another, but for where you come from and also your personal journeys. This masculine knows you. And what's interesting is that they knew that you would make this choice if you had to. They just didn't know that it was going to affect them on this level. This is why they're lingering in your energy field now. Because they want you to know that they are tired. They're tired of fighting and resisting the fact that they will never stop loving you, okay? And what's interesting is this realization has instantly shifted them from being in this really stagnant energy to being more in the present moment, but also thinking about the future. I keep getting future, okay? So they're thinking of where you both will be years from now, okay? 
they pray about you, divine feminine. They wonder if God will bring you back together. If so, they wonder when, okay? They also think about how you will receive them as well. But what I'm getting so strongly here is that they wonder if you will actually leave them behind. This is very powerful. Um, and they think about the pain that they would feel knowing that you are the person that God sent them. The person that they will literally never stop loving in this lifetime and they blew it. That's where this, this such, you know, intensity is coming from at this time and this sense of urgency as it pertains to them wanting to speak to you and wanting to articulate this in a way where you really can receive it because they can feel your energy and they may feel like you are completely just over it at this time, okay? And because of the cyclic theme of your connection, um, this is someone who viewed the time away from you as a temporary thing. They never wanted this to be permanent. And so their higher self is coming through and affirming you in a way, Divine Feminine, letting you know that what you picked up on from them was absolutely correct. They were unconsciously fighting this at one point. And you had to respond to their actions in the way that you did. And they respect this, okay? This actually makes them even more attracted to you because you know who you are, even outside of this connection, which is very attractive to them. But it's really important for you to know this at this time. They're, they're really highlighting this, okay? That they're extremely tired of wasting their energy when they know that this won't change anything, okay? It won't change how they feel. It won't change their love for you, okay? No matter the time, no matter the space, they know this for a fact, okay? And they want you to know this as well. Wow. Let's get the next message here. This is very beautiful energy. The next message we have here is, you're my one true love. Yeah. I feel like your person is coming through in this reading, letting you know all the things that's been on their heart lately. And what's being highlighted here is that this masculine is in love with you. And while you may know this, you're at a place on your journey, Divine Feminine, where you require more from them. And your energy is coming through very strong. So you may be really missing your masculine, but something won't let you budge at this time. And they can feel your love, but they also can feel how serious you are, okay? You're someone who came into this connection knowing your worth. And that hasn't changed. And honestly, this, this is what's kept them lingering in your energy. They definitely view you as a great catch. But if they were to be 100% honest with you, this new realization has completely threw them for a loop and has you standing out in their minds and, and in their hearts simply because you're the one person that they will love for the rest of their lives. And the fact that you have been through the stages of this connection and their feelings haven't changed at all says something. Okay, it's saying something huge, even if they haven't said it to you, but they want to, okay? They seek to affirm you and your connection in a much deeper way. And they may begin by letting you know all of this. Their energy is coming through very serious as well. It's almost like when they come to you, Divine Feminine, they don't want you to do anything but listen to them. And maybe they feel this way because they have held back a lot, okay? You will be amazed at how much they felt at certain moments or with certain situations and they have not commented on them at all or haven't expressed anything to you at all. They definitely want to purge this, okay? And they know that you are currently operating in a very receptive state which is naturally pushing them into a way more active state here, okay? So 
I don't know if you feel this divine feminine, but there's definitely some type of natural balance that's taking place within your connection right now. You're operating in your higher self, and so is your divine masculine, okay? Let's get the last message here. Okay, so the last message is, I appreciate you. This is such beautiful energy, okay? The overall energy right now is very high vibrational, okay? Not only in this connection, but also on the planet. So right now, we're currently under the influence of the full moon in Leo, which is very powerful, bold, and bright energy. And it's really calling us to step into who we really are, okay? And I feel like you're feeling the effects of this right now, especially your masculine, which is very, 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 very beautiful, okay? I just got offer very clearly. So whatever they're feeling right now has them thinking about making some kind of gesture to show you how much they appreciate you. And the way their energy is coming through, they want to do this simply to see where you are, Divine Feminine. So this may even start off small and then gradually increase over time. It's almost as if they want to see where your mind is. And they're planning on making this move in, in your direction with respect to where you are on your personal journey. So depending on where you are, you may be totally open to this. For some of you, you may still need time to think about this, okay? Because I'm picking up on strong emotions that you're feeling for this masculine, which may be a mix of positive and negative, okay? But very intense, okay? So your person has definitely been lingering in your energy heavy, and I'm getting that you're picking up on this. You may be wondering why, and this is why, okay? They've had this sort of wake-up call about you, and what's interesting is that although they've had these really intense feelings for you from the beginning, they never looked at your connection the way that they do right now. It's like this masculine is always finding reasons to love you even more than they already do. Because this connection has a way of revealing new information. And right now, they are aware that it's you, okay? And it's always been you even before they came in contact with you, okay? They have always loved you. And that's something that will never stop for their entire existence on this planet, okay? Wow, very powerful energy. And where they are right now, they wanna express this to you, okay? They wanna know if you know this, how you feel about this. And they're hoping that you will be really receptive to them and really allow them to show you with their actions how they feel about you at this time. I also want to point out that although they are feeling very, very bold, okay, very confident in themselves, this is really giving them, you know, a deeper understanding of themselves and is really allowing them to feel more comfortable operating in their higher selves simply because this is where you meet them. You've set a standard, Divine Feminine. From the very, very beginning, you're someone who came into this connection knowing your worth, knowing who you are, okay, and showing up as your highest version. And when your person couldn't meet you there, they begin to unconsciously fight what it was that they were feeling. But as they begin to think about this, there's a huge difference when they're in your energy, when they're operating in a space when it's okay for them to be their best and when they're not, okay? And so this really has been pulling on them a lot and has them kind of lingering, wondering what it is that you're doing. If they have any type of visual access to you, they're definitely watching you. Um, definitely trying to figure out how to come at you, okay? Because your energy is coming through so strong. It's like you're communicating with them even if you're not in contact, okay? So although they're feeling very bold, 
they may want to start small, okay? By taking just a small move in your direction, maybe shooting you a text, maybe inviting you out somewhere, okay? And seeing how you will respond. And if they can actually increase their action over time, depending on how you respond to them, okay? And so when they initiate this gesture or this small offer to you, Divine Feminine, they will be paying very close attention to how you receive them, okay? Um, and this will be, you know, a means to alert them if they can expand this over time, okay? So right now, if you're wondering how your energy is directly affecting them, it's absolutely triggering them, okay? But in the best way possible. And they really appreciate you for this Divine Feminine because they've come into the awareness that you are literally the only person who can do this, okay? And what they feel for you at this time is something that will never ever go away. It's only going to expand. They only find more reasons to fall deeper in love with you, okay? This is a very, very beautiful reading. All right, love, I'm gonna go ahead and end it here. If you resonated with this message, be sure to hit the like button on the way out. If you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to the channel and I will see you all in the next video. Bye.